what's up guys so this video isn't going to be like a tutorial as you can see by the title of the video uh, it's going to be explaining how to change the textures and the car holes to make your vehicle flash certain colors etc since people uh, that run servers don't know how to do this but uh, yeah so I've been working on this in the uh, tutorial so it's got a uh, visor bar your main light bar and it's got a red deck light so since we're still working on that I'm just gonna go ahead and make a copy all right so we're gonna go in the texture directory so we got Buno lights here we've got emerge lights emerge lights 4 I think that's all the lights yeah so basically you grab your lights that look like lights <laughs> um, and throw them in your paint on that whatever Photoshop and all you want to do is basically copy it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make mine all blue. So we're just going to go ahead and do this. Copy that one to here. And simple as that. I'm just going to make sure to do these just to be 100% safe. <laughs> if I uh, sound stuff in shit, I'm getting sick and it's hot in Australia. So I want to shoot myself. But um, yeah, we just want to match these up as good as possible. That looks good to me. <clears throat> Normally I do these down here. I'm not sure what these actually specify towards um, lighting. I've never really used or seen those being used. But you save this. You do exactly the same for this. So just copy this. I dislike why it has a massive wheel inside <laughs> in the middle of it. But sure. So it looks... A oh. yeah, I hate when it does that. So we're trying to try and match them up. Right, that looks good here. Do the exact same thing for the bottom part. Get, get down, don't go over. There we go. And now the Buno lights. So this has three different modules. You got like your weird looking one. You got like your ions and then your main light bar texture. Since these two down here are set properly, we can just copy these two and just move these over here. And then we go from the blue copy great you know it's done so let's just quickly go ahead and go in the vehicle and we're gonna go ahead and take a look in the visor bar as you will see I don't know if it's this side. yeah here so it's got red here and then over here we'll have blue you can see so once we throw in these textures it's gonna turn to all blue so now they're in we save the vehicle we land out load because Obviously, it likes to uh, take months. But if we check now, we come in here, that blue. We come in here, and that blue. As you can see, we check the light bar. All blue there, and then all blue here. Alright, so you're done with the physical look of the light. Now you want to change the ambient lighting. Ambient lighting is where it reflects off walls, uh, other cars, etc. So, I'm going to have this in the description. This is normally what I do. I will put these as well, just if you have XBR's vehicles, so you understand how to do it on that part. But, uh, I'm just using the uh, Captain 14's one. These are the most common used um, ambient colours. So, what we're going to do, is we want to come here. Car calls, so you want to go to your car calls. Uh, make sure you use Nova Plus Plus, because that's like the best thing out there. So, what we're going to do, is we want to copy this red one, right here. So, I've gone to replace here. And then we want to replace it with blue. So now we're going to replace all. It replace 10. So that'd be a total of 20 sirens, 10 red, 10 blue. So now we're going to go ahead and get in game. And I'll be back with you guys in a minute. Alrighty, we're in game. So the spawn name for my vehicle that I change is Charger. <coughs> so, as you can see, visor bar, all blue. Same as the light bar, same as the rear deck lights. So what I'll do is I'll change it tonight. And if you look, everything is blue. Since that I'm rotating my lights, it's just frontal. But if you look, on say that's an ambient lighting part here. So that's blue. So you got that part ready? Good. If yours looks right, you should be able to see your dummies. They should be all blue. As you can see, two dummies here, two here, two here. That works perfectly fine. So that's how you change light textures and charcoal colors. Since uh, it seems like people don't really understand it, I'm gonna be doing another video on uh, tutorials for metas because that is the number one priority for when owning a server and or running a community. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. And uh, yeah, enjoy me dying. <laughs>